Right guys, this is Guards 1001. Uh, we were talking today about a woman setting herself on fire in a hospital with an e-cig. Now, I've had a little test. And basically this is it. That's dual 0.3 ohm coils on a Trident with a freshly charged Samsung cell. I also have this. So, what we've got here is oxygen and propane. You'll also see I've got a rag, which is going to be our blanket analogue. Now the first thing, oxygen on its own. That's the blue tap connected to the blue regulator. I'll open it up. I have tried this. Oxygen doesn't burn. Not directly anyway. Propane does. Like so. Now we'll just turn the propane off. And we'll purge it. Hopefully the microphone will pick that up. There's us purging it off. There is no propane here at all. Now what I'm saying I think happened, we'll use our blanket analog. If we get the coils going again, I don't really think it's likely she was dry burning a 40 watt dripper, but you never know. Anyway, if I apply oxygen to this blanket, maybe that'll cause something to happen. So there we go. So it is possible if she's got a 40 watt dripper and her oxygen feed has oxygenated a blanket for an e-cig to cause a fire. Do I think that's what's happened? Mm, I don't think so myself. I suspect it might be some, some other source of ignition. But I suppose it's possible. Maybe the papers are right. <laughs> 